hello friends welcome to Rexpo youtube channel so today we are going to learn about doing various type of calculations in single user form that is addition multiplication subtraction division and percentage so let me give you one example here i have two figures here and i wanted to get addition so here is the total amount I want to multiply by 100 with 5 and I get the right amount here. I want to subtract 5 out of 100. I get the amount here. I just have to click on this button. I don't have to do calculation on various calculators or on phone. If I have to divide this, then I get the answer here. Sometimes what happens, you have to get the percentage as, as well. So I went to a shop and I buy an item for 100 rupees and another item for 500 rupees. So what happened? The total is 600. And I asked the guy to give me 5% discount. So what is the amount of 5% of 600? It is 30. And the net total I have to pay to the shopkeeper is 570. So these are the buttons we can use our user form to do simple calculations in a very effective and efficient way so let me show you the coding as well of this calculation various calculations form friends if you are beginner you just have to go to insert tab and click on user form you will get this user form here but like I have made this user form the second step would be you have to click on this toolbox so from here we get the text box like this way and label from this all right friends so this is a simple way i have used all these labels from here and the text box from here if i have to use a combo box then this is the combo box we can use here so for the time being we, we are just going to see the coding of the calculation form let me get you through so click double click on addition button and we start getting the coding here this is very simple coding you have to use addition symbol minus symbol multiplication division and percentage so friends this is the very simple coding so you are quite wondering about what is text box 3 and 1 and 2 let me show you if you click here and you see on the right side bottom this is text box 1 so let me get it here so this is text box 1 if I bring it down this is text box 2 this is text box 3 this is text box 4 5 5 and this one is 6 so 1 plus 2 equal to this text box 3 is there equal to 1 plus 2 that is text box 1 plus text box 2 the value over here uh, don't just get through the text box 1 and 2 you have to mention the proper coding like this value all right friends and same we have been using for addition multiplication percentage and division uh, let me show you the percentage coding this is the percentage coding which I highlighted over here with it's how we can calculate the percentage all right friends and let me do another example that how we can do these calculations and start getting the answers I wanted to get 10% of this amount and then wanted to deduct this amount from this amount and 
I get not total here. So that's how we can calculate the various calculation by using multiplication, subtraction, and division. I hope you like the video friends. And if you like and share my video, I will make more video on user form where you will be able to learn about school user form, the database user form, the freeze format user form, and so on. I hope you like the video and I request you please like and share this user form 